Hi everyone, Jason here. It is another Juice Along With Jason lockdown special. It is the penultimate one, the penultimate blend. Thank you to everybody uh, from all over the world actually that's been watching uh, the videos and giving feedback on the recipes and suggesting certain tweaks. Because uh, these, if you, I don't know where you've been, if this is the first time you're tuning in, um, I'm making a load of new recipes for the new book, which is a plan, it's like juice and blend me plan. I've explained it all on other videos anyway. If this is your first time tuning in, just check out some of the back catalog of the mini lockdown series. They're all on the YouTube channel, they're on Instagram TV, they'll remain up there for a short while. Um, we've got something, this blend is gorgeous, right? But your decision matters, so your opinion uh, matters on this. So if you don't like it, it might not go in the book. But sometimes when you've got a blend with things like coconut and almond butter and you just got a nice coconut milk and some, some fruit uh, and a little bit of protein powder, it's very hard to get it wrong, uh, to be honest with you. So, so this is, but tomorrow, like you're gonna love this, but tomorrow, uh, the, the goji peanut butter chocolate smoothie thing that I'm making, I haven't got a name for it yet, but hopefully by then I will, because uh, we're gonna finish in style tomorrow with the ultimate blend. Uh, that's what I call it, and hopefully that will go in the, in the book too. These are bonus recipes for the book. Uh, for this one, you're not gonna need your juicer, it's the weekend, you don't wanna clean your juicer. Uh, some of you are doing the plans, so hats off to everybody. Some of you come to the end of the plan. I wanna hear, listen, if you've been doing a seven day plan, 21 day plan, whatever it is, and you're coming to the end of it, let us know over the weekend, tell me how you're feeling. I'm gonna be all over the Instagram, and so, the Instagram, <laughs> all over Instagram. There's no, all over the Instagram, you know what I'm saying anyway. Here's what you're gonna need. 300 milliliters of coke. Oh, by the way, the name of this recipe is um, Fruit and Nutcase Super Blend. Everyone's a fruit and nutcase. You probably gather it's got fruit and nuts in, uh, but not whole nuts. I was toying with the idea, and you can just get a handful of cashews and just put them in, but actually you tend to, they tend to be quite heavy, um, those kind of uh, smoothies. So you kind of, it's more controlled when it's a nut butter and it's a heaped teaspoon. Um, so we're gonna go 300 milliliters of coconut milk or any plant milk, but as it's a fruit and nut case, super blend, I would keep with the nut theme if you can. Um, then I just got mixed berries, frozen. Um, I've got strawberries, blackberries and blueberries there. That's the antioxidant kids go, uh, kings going in, uh, vitamins, but I've also added in some fresh pineapple chunks. So I've just cut those up and it's like a small handful. You can get frozen. So that, that might already be in your mixed bag of frozen fruits. And a lot of people say, well, is, is fresh better than frozen? They've done studies to show that it depends on the season, but certainly in the winter months, there's no question that if you buy frozen berries of any kind, they're more nutritious when they are frozen because when they were picked, then they got frozen straight away as opposed to what's deemed as fresh on the shelves. In fact, in some cases, um, the chart of how much vitamin C, because that's what they normally test, but how much vitamin C, it was off the scale on frozen and down here on fresh. That changed slightly when obviously fruits we're in season in the summer, um, but the rule of thumb is frozen still locks in the goodness. Our frozen delivery business, of course, that's part and parcel of that. Um, already said the pineapple. I've got some hemp and pea protein powder. Stuff to, I just like to make it a protein-rich smoothie. We're going to do it. It's got protein in anyway because the nut butter. And we're going to a heaped teaspoon. Of, I've got coconut and almond. I've got two kind of nuts going on there, but whatever. Even if it's just almond butter or whatever the case is. All you're going to need is your blender for this and... Couldn't be easier, it's not like you're just, you're literally just pouring in everything. Remember the nut butter goes in last. You do not want it to stick anywhere. Protein powder going in. I'm even gonna add the milk in. You can even, if you haven't got frozen uh, fruits, you're using fresh for whatever reason, um, then add some ice to this. Now I'm going heaped. Oh yes, I am. Oh yes, a heaped teaspoon. There you go. Don't lick the spoon. <laughs> And we're gonna blend this for around about 30 seconds, 40 seconds. Uh, if you've got one of these particular blenders, um, um, some people have got a Vitamix, some people have got like uh, uh, Magic, whatever the case is. Uh, this is our own, this is our super blend. Um, I always put it on the carrot and apple, which is kind of the hard fruit and veg, but I don't leave it on that long. That'll take about 40 seconds, something like that. There we go, 40 seconds in, that'll do it nicely. Just make sure that all of the ice, if you have put ice in, if not the frozen berries, have all come together. This is going to be 
nice and thick, but not too thick. Remember this, again, I always repeat this, this is not like a meal in a glass. This is a meal in a glass and you have to treat it as such. So the time that it would have taken you to eat the ingredients, unlike a juice where all that insoluble fiber has been taken away. What you're looking for here is to make sure that anything that you blend, no matter if it's a, a vegetable blend or a fruit blend, what you're looking to do is make sure that how long would it have taken you to eat those particular fruits and veg, and that's how long it should take you to drink your blend. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say it's nutty and fruity. Because it's a fruit nut case, that should take you about 10 or 15 minutes. Don't gulp that down. You know, this is the idea of this, it's a protein super blend. Ideally, I keep saying it, it depends on when you exercise, you up, you get hydrated water straight in your body on wakening. If you can and you've got enough time, you then exercise, do something, yoga, mini trampolining, go out for a run, bike ride, whatever it is, you then come back. If you've done weights or whatever the case is and you've blitzed your muscles, then this is in that golden hour. That's when you want to make the breakfast. Mm. And you have that. If, look, if that doesn't go in the book, I'm going to think there's something wrong with you. If that doesn't get at least an 8 out of 10, it's got to get 8 out of 10 or above to go in the book. <clears throat> it's very rare that something gets 10 out of 10. But I'm giving myself a challenge. Because tomorrow's one. Oh, yes. Um, it's the final one tomorrow. So hopefully you can just tune in. It's the final one. They're going to remain on YouTube, like I said, for a little while, whatever, but they will eventually just be taken down. Next week, we're moving on something else, which I'm going to tell you all about in tomorrow's video. And then we've been talking with the team, funnily enough, this morning, just while we were doing this and think, do you know what? While people are on lockdown, why don't we have a big juice challenge? <clears throat> it's up to you. Let me know what you think about a big juice challenge. Uh, we're going to do, we were going to do a reset, <clears throat> which I don't normally do daily videos for. But anyway, we're thinking on put it, putting on a challenge and relatively soon, probably in June, something like Super Juice Me for Summer. And then literally you can just write in every day and then I can just do videos every day and literally we can just connect in that way. A couple of Instagram lives and this, that and the other. Uh, for those that are thinking of doing a full plan after this, that might be something you're interested in. Anyway, there you go. That is the Fruit Nut Case. Hopefully everybody is a Fruit Nut Case, as the song would say. Um, everyone's a Fruit Nut Case. Uh, super blend. I uh, hope you enjoy it. Happy Saturday, everybody, and I'll see you for the peanut butter goji berry chocolate super blend tomorrow. Cheers.